So it's Wednesday, August 27, 2014 at 1020 a.m. Let me show you something. There's something that happens to targets, um, especially when you're a new target and you don't know what the hell is going on. They do something called synchronization or colors where you'll go out and you'll see people wearing the same color or driving the same colored car or using a number or something where you const you're constantly being forced to see it. It's a psychological, there's two things that happen. Number one, it psychologically terrorizes you. And number two, what it's doing is it's trying to condition you. You know, power of suggestion, power of association. So say they did something very negative, and then you go out and everything you see is the color red. And then whenever you see that color, they, so they'll do something else that's negative. So then you begin to associate the color red with something negative. When you're an unsuspecting target, so it's patterns of association that they try to utilize to psychologically traumatize you. So I'm going to show you something here. And this was yesterday. It was a Pennsylvania plate that showed up. And so I can, t I can spot perpetrators because there's just something about their demeanor and their nature and so what happened was yesterday, it didn't dawn on me because like I said, this has to be, it's a, a quick few seconds. But what I want to show you is the color. Okay, patterns and colors, right? So here's a couple in the color. I guess I could play it, but it'll clip really fast. It, I mean, it's literally, it was a 20 second video, a second. I was taking the license plate of the vehicle, so I wasn't paying, I didn't care about the people. But I'm glad that it ended up showing up. So I'm just trying to show you the color. I guess I shouldn't do that because I'll probably tweak with your eyes. So I'll do it slow in slow motion. So they were wearing like that salmon color, okay? There are a couple. You see that? So their pattern was to wear the salmon color. Or, or I, what it is is that the network, okay? This network of civilian perpetrators goes out. They are told, they're given instructions for the day. Target will be here. Target's going to do that. So this one was... Couples, if you're a couple and you're a part of the perpetrator network, this domestic terrorist perpetrator network, we, we, need, we want you to wear not just the same color, but the same pattern or whatever, so that if we're targeting people in Los Angeles, those targets, they will begin to see you guys all around Los Angeles. It's kind of like flash mobbing. And they synchronize. So it's not the same color today. What they're doing is they're doing couples wearing the same color or the same pattern. Okay, so I'm showing you this one. It's literally a, a, a one second video. I mean one second. But what I wanted to show was the pattern. And it didn't even dawn on me until last night. This one perpetrator that lives in the building by the name of Michael Hassan refuses to close the exterior door at nighttime. So he comes in with his girlfriend, and lo and behold, she's wearing the same kind of shirt. Okay? Like I said, these clips are so fast that I, I'm just repeating the clip. You would actually have to slow it down when you see the YouTube video. Okay, so the, the orders that went out to the Los Angeles Perpetrator Network, because they are a network in Los Angeles, would be if you're a couple, you guys wear either the same color or the same pattern, so that when you're wandering around Los Angeles and the person is targeted because they understand this bombardment, you're going to see them in the same either color or pattern. But this was couples. Okay? Same thing here. This Pennsylvania Korean couple showed up yesterday in the morning. I can spot the perps. So they were told, synchronize. You see what they do? They're synchronizing. Same thing here. Last night, this perpetrator by the name Michael Hassan that I had to call LAPD on because he physically assaulted me, and that damn owner of this building doesn't do shit about it. They're coming in from the open door, 
and he is refusing to close it. But this is what I'm looking at. Pattern. You see? Now, if I'd have been out yesterday, I would have seen couples in patterns or colors. So what they do is the network is given the network, this perpetrator network, civilian sleeper cell network. They are provided information, provided information, and then they will synchronize each other or they know what each other is supposed to do for the day. So this is in the evening. So they've been wearing it all day. They didn't just go change their clothes. She's walking in from outside. He had to let her in because it was after it was almost 11 o'clock. So right here, note the date at the bottom of the camera is not correct. It's from China. It was a generic version. I can't change it. So I give you the physical date um, or I'll read out a date. So this happened last night. You can go back to another YouTube video and I'll show the actual date of the upload to YouTube of the whole video.